for a front pressing, we're gonna move the shovel either all the way up or shovel front rack. Brace on the ground. Again, bottom arm leads the dance. And what we're trying to do here is work off the horizontal angles that we're usually pulling and pushing in. So, of course, this is valuable and possible, and it's useful because the top hand is upside down, but it's a pattern that we've used before. If we start getting into a little bit more angled pressing, it's, it's parts of the arm that I've never felt before. That's the least scientific way I can think about talking about it. And hunt the ones that tell you what you need to know. If you do this and it feels like nothing, easy. That's not the one to stay on. It's this one. Or this one. If the bottom arm wiggles, the top arm will wiggle also. Just put the mace down safely. Don't fight through weird presses and weird angles in unstable positions. There's a difference between unstable and valuable and unstable and dangerous. It's usually based, it's usually based on effort. So lead arm stays straight. As we're pressing from the front rack, we're pulling our hips forward and our shoulders back, just like we did holding for a minute. And this is a push-pull. So if you just push, and you think it's just gonna come back, it won't. Drive it out, stay engaged, pull it back. So, mace overhead press, mace front press, adaptations of each. Questions on that so far. Once we start practicing, questions will come up. We're right out of the gate, we're good. Question three times, hand width in the front press. So overhead press hand width as narrow as you can get makes a lot of sense. Really tough, really valuable. Front press, anything, I've, I've, I've practiced as much as I've practiced and since we invented it, I guess I've probably practiced more than anybody. Anything inside the framework of your push-up feels unsafe and, and squirrely in the wrong ways to be. Anything at or outside the framework of your push-up is great. So, excellent question. Overhead, as narrow as you can structurally bear is valuable. That would be about it because now it's forcing a tiny bend in the bottom arm. Front press, anything narrower than this felt like I was forcing something I shouldn't be forcing. Good? Yeah. Okay, as you were. Thank you. Yeah.